Hi everyone, welcome. I'm Paula and this is Ed and we are out for a walk. It has been, oh, here comes the car. We got sidetracked by the mail truck. Um, so we are out for a walk. It has been raining. It rained all day yesterday and it's raining still right now, it's sprinkling, but it's starting to taper off. We had to get out. So we are taking a walk in the woods with the doggy. When we get back, we're gonna make some breakfast. And what are we gonna have? I don't know, we haven't even talked about what we're gonna have yet for breakfast. So um, we're gonna decide that. And then when we do, I'll be showing you what we're having today to eat. We really don't have a plan for today at all, like as far as what we're gonna be eating. We should do those ribs tonight. We'll see in a little bit. Oh yeah, we have some um, spare ribs, a whole rack. They are thawing in the refrigerator and we're thinking about, we were gonna do it last night, but we didn't have enough time. Thinking about smoking those tonight on the little Kamado grill that we have. And so I think we will do that tonight for dinner. And so breakfast is still undecided. We'll let you know when we get to that point. So we'll see you in just a little bit. Look at that big wasp nest. Must have fallen out of this tree. Stay away, Sapphira. Ah, ah, ah. Look at that. Wow, it's huge. So we're having breakfast. Ed just made some eggs and some bacon. And then I have some coffee with a little bit of heavy cream. And he's having the same thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat and I'll see you later on. Looking in here, checking it out. So it has finally quit raining and we were able to come outside. I brought Sapphira down here to the water and she's playing in the water. And today is Sapphira's birthday. She is five years old today. I thought how appropriate for her to be able to play in the lake on her birthday. So it is almost four o'clock. Ed is getting the charcoal going in the little Kamado grill that we've got. And we're gonna smoke these ribs. And this is the way that I prepare them. I take a rack of ribs and I season them and I roll them up into a roll. I'll show you when we put it on there why I roll it up like this because it's a small space. So I'll do that. All right, so I have my little setup here. I have my uh, Grillo's pickles here. I have some sandwich slices and some round chips. I'm gonna use both of these. And I have my air fryer basket right here. I'm gonna be cooking these in my Z-Star air grill. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I do this. So I take the pickle and dip it in some egg. And then I dip it in the crumbs and put it in the air fryer basket. Very simple. Recipe for this breading is over on my website, lowcarbrevelation.com. Go over there and search breading, and it's actually called crispy breading, and you can find the recipe for it. I do take these pickles and I pat them dry on a paper towel because that's what helps the egg to stick to it. If they're wet with pickle juice, they're not. the egg is not gonna stick to it. So I make sure that I pat them dry. All right, so I'm gonna put these in my Z-Star Air Grill. I'm gonna use the Air Crisp setting and I'm going to put it on about 15 minutes and I will flip them halfway through. Okay, these are going in the Kamado Grill. Got the wood chips. Nice technique. <laughs> Pro status. All right. So we have to position these towards the back so we clear a little sensor up yeah, there. Yeah, that's the reason why we rolled them up. Waiting on the ribs, they're gonna take a little while, so I made a little appetizer. Ooh-wee! Air fried pickles. 
How are they? Awesome. Really Better good. Better than any restaurant. Got some ranch on the side. The breading yeah. is phenomenal. Yeah, that's that crispy breading. I'm telling you, it's so good. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So good. My tummy's doing happy dance. Okay. These are great. We'll be back when the ribs are done. All right, so Ed is saucing up these rib sections with um, my homemade barbecue sauce. The recipe for that is over on my website. And let's get these out of the way. And he's gonna throw them back on here. You can see that the charcoal is still glowing. And so he's gonna throw them back on there and get that little crust on the barbecue sauce. You want to give me some tongs? Yep. Okay, so ribs and coleslaw. Ribs and coleslaw. <laughs> Have you tried the ribs yet? No. Nope. Haven't tried them yet. Mmm. Such good flavor. It's a smoke. You can really taste the smoke. Mm -hmm. Barbecue sauce is good. Yeah, very good. Nice mm. job. Thank you. My tummy is going to be so happy. Mm -hmm. So we're about to get really messy. So let me go ahead and sign off for today. Make sure you subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. See you really soon. Have a great day. And God bless. We have some, um, uh, what do you call those? Like a rack of ribs? Right. Spare ribs? Right. We have like a long rack of, <laughs> what is it called? Spare ribs. Okay, we have some spare ribs. And we are going to, oh, no. <clears throat> All right, so let's see. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> Turn it around here. Oops. <laughs>